Hi boys and girls, how are you today? All right, let's go ahead and start off with our calendar today. Are you ready? I hope you guys are practicing because the next time I see you, I want you to read the, the months of the year to me. All right, let's start, ready? January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. So, what month are we in? We said we're in the month of April. It's the fourth month of the year. All right. So, we said yesterday was Monday. So, if yesterday was Monday, what day is it today? It's Tuesday. Good job. Let's sing our song. Ready? Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, the days of the week. Good job. Okay, so let's see how many days in April we're in. Ready? Let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight. So today is Tuesday, April twenty-eighth. 2020 just a few more days in April and what's the next month what well, comes after April May a few more days in April and we'll be in May so boys and girls what season are we in if we look outside there's plants there's flowers everything's green we are in spring Springtime. I know it's kind of hot already. It's almost summertime, but not yet. We're still in spring. Very good. We'll be planting some really pretty flowers. All right, boys and girls. So we've been talking about our community helpers. So we read this book last week, but I wanted to focus on one very important community helper. And if we look at the page over here, it's the postal worker. The postal worker is in charge of giving us our mail. He's in charge of delivering our packages. Okay? So he's a very important community worker. And I'll tell you what, boys and girls. Look at these are this is my mail. Woohoo! I got a lot of mail here that I need to go through. Boys and girls, look. He even sends us coupons. Well, this coupon is for Burger King. Yum, 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 yum. Maybe I'll go tomorrow to Burger King. But it sends a coupon. They send all this stuff in the mail so to make sure that you're up to date with all the things that are going on. But I have a lot of mail. All right, I'll look at it tomorrow. Or the next day, or the next day, I don't know. So, today's activity is about a pattern. And these are items that a postal worker uses. Well, we use them too. The first item is a stamp. A stamp, boys and girls, is something we need to put on our letter in order for it to get there. If we don't have a stamp, it's not going to get there. A stamp is like paying the, the fee of what it needs to be delivered. So depending on how big your package is, depends on the stamp. So if it doesn't have the stamp, it's not gonna get there. It needs the stamp. Okay, so here we go. Anybody know what this is? It's a mail truck. That's what they use to deliver our mail. All right, are we ready to do our pattern? Ready? Stamp, mail truck. Stamp. So what's missing? What's next? Mail truck. Ready? Let's read our sentence. I see a mail truck. Let's see. Here it goes. Let's read our whole pattern. Stamped. Mail truck. Stamp. Mail truck. Good job. Let's do the next one. Ready? All right, what is that? Mail 
mailbox, mail. So what's next? You're right, mailbox. And what color is a mailbox? Blue. Let's read our sentence, ready? I see a mailbox. Good job. All right, let's do the next one. That one's a little bit harder. It's a little bit harder, you ready? Mailbox, mail, stamp, mailbox, mail. What's, what's missing? You're right, a stamp. Good job. Let's read our sentence, ready? I see a stamp. Good job. So that's where it goes, our stamp. Last one. Ready? Mail truck, stamp, mail, mail truck, stamp. What, what's missing? You're right, the mail. Good job, let's read our sentence, ready? I see a mail. Well, it's actually, it's like a letter, right? It's mail. Good job, boys and girls. All right, so that's today's activity. So tomorrow, we're gonna be working, we already worked on our letters Z and Q, so tomorrow we'll work on our letters O and J. All right, good job boys and girls. Have a great day. Bye, see you tomorrow.